What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna make a quick video showing you guys how to put the rear brake ducts on the Z06. So from the factory, they don't install your rear brake ducts. I've already installed the brake duct on the passenger side. You can see why from the factory they don't install them because it hangs down pretty low. It's for track use only. Here's another angle from the front side. You can see they're just a couple inches off the ground. So that's why they don't want you driving around the street with them. But honestly, for me, that's taller than my front splitter. So I'm gonna keep them on all the time. I like to keep them on 24 seven because I tend to forget to put them back on when I go to the track. Like yesterday, I ran around the whole session without any brake ducts. So that was terrible but it's a pretty easy install. Each brake duct is two pieces, a top and a bottom. The driver's side is labeled LH, so left hand. The passenger side is right hand. The kit comes with two different types of bolts, one for the top, one for the bottom. The instructions say to jack it up and take off the rear wheel, but I was able to do it with just jacking it up. You're gonna need two sockets, a seven mil and an eight mil. The kit comes with six clips. You're gonna take these to the top piece. The top piece, you can identify it with these brackets on the inside. You're gonna take these clips and just pop them in place. These pop in really easy. Just make sure you have the right orientation where the nut is on the back, so when you put the screw in, it's gonna screw into the nut. The top piece bolts up with these three eight millimeter bolts. Hey guys, real quick, I'm on the Chip Miller Foundation website where they're giving away a 2023 Z06 with Z07 performance package. This thing's completely loaded. It's a 3LZ, Z07 package, carbon ceramic brakes. And because you guys are rear wheel drive viewer, you guys are getting 50% more entries. Just click the link in the description below. This closes on September 23rd. The drawing date is on September 30th. Good luck. Once you get the brake duct in place, you can see where the bolt holes line up. I got these machine screws started by hand. They don't take very much to tighten. I believe the instructions say three and a half foot pounds of torque. Once you get the top piece bolted up, you'll take the six seven millimeter screws and bolt the bottom piece to the top piece. I got the brake duct lined up and started all these by hand and I believe these only take 1.85 foot pounds of torque, so not very much at all. And after just a few easy minutes, you got them installed, you're good to go, ready for the track. As always guys, thanks for watching, we'll see you in the next video.